Good morning, Chiefs. I am Alejandra. And I'm Juan, and this is Chief TV. Hi, I'm Demi Tellez from Chief TV, and I'm with... Mr. Jim Krupa. <laughs> okay, Mr. Krupa, I hear a little buzz going around the seniors thing. Can mm -hmm. you tell us more about what's happening doing scene for seniors? Okay, we'll go over some important dates. We have a lot of stuff going on, like senior uh, awards night, and we have uh, tailgate night. But I'm going to uh, kind of focus in on graduation. How's that? That's very good. Okay. Can you tell us more about it? Well, seniors, let's, let's start from the beginning. Remember, on May 2nd and 3rd, those are the days that are scheduled for senior semester exams if you need to take those. And if you need to take them, you need to talk with your teachers and find out when and how long they're going to last because you have to be off campus on those days on May 2nd and 3rd by 11 o'clock. Mm -hmm. So talk with all your teachers on those days. That's the start of graduation process. Then on May 9th, that's a, a next important day, that's Tuesday, that's checkout day. And how we do checkout, we do it in the pack, and we do it by alpha, by your last name. It goes by your last name, and I'm going to give you the times and your alpha right now. We've already, it's already included in your senior letter, and if you haven't got that, you can stop by the main office. But here's how it breaks down. 7.30 to 8.30, A through E. 8.30 to 9.30, F through N. And 9.30 to 10.30, O through Z. So you have that breakdown and only show up during, it's your last name and only through show up during that time. You can't show up, if you're a Z, you can't show up when the A's are going because you won't be let in. Remember, at checkout time, you'll receive your cap and gown at that time. And speaking of cap and gown, remember, take it home, hang it up, don't do anything to the cap. You can't write on the cap. The only thing that you're allowed to do on your cap is put your name on the inside because I'll, we'll go over that at graduation practice. But you only put your name on the inside. Don't mess with the um, tassel either. Then we're going to go to May 11th, rehearsal. I just mentioned rehearsal. May 11th is rehearsal, and it starts at 2.15 in the afternoon. So you need to get here. And by, I'm going to back up a little bit. The checkout is in the pack. The checkout is in the pack. You park in student parking or you get dropped off there and then you leave immediately. You're not allowed, by the way, after checkout to walk around campus. You're to leave. Now we're back at, that, that was my fault, on May 11th, re rehearsal, we start at 2.15. Again, you go to student parking, park there, or get dropped off in the student parking lot. You come into the gym. That's where we do the, the uh, rehearsal. And it'll start promptly at 2.30. Doors will shut down at 2.30. If you're not in, you can't practice. And if you don't attend practice, you don't participate in graduation. So you just wasted 12, 13 years of your life just because you missed practice. So make sure you're on time, 2.15 on May 11th, and it's going to be in the gym. And again, we park in student parking lot. Um, and then, of course, May 15th is graduation. It's 8 o'clock in the morning, but you seniors need to be there at 6.15 in the morning. And the same thing goes. I mean, if you feel like you're going to you cross train tracks and you know you're going to get caught by that train every time, leave a little bit early. We shut down at, at 6.30 where you can't, we don't let any more seniors in at 6.30. There's a special door for you and we're going to go over that at rehearsal. And again, as you come into the, it's at South Florida Fairgrounds, mm -hmm. and as you come in South Florida Fairgrounds, um, you'll be checked. They have wanders and all that and they have metal detectors. They check that. They check for your dress. Check your cap again because if you don't have a proper cap, if something's written on it, you don't go in, you don't graduate. So that, that goes for that. Um, and it starts at 8 o'clock. But tell your parents or the people you, you, your guests from about 10 till 8 till about 10 after 8, they shut the doors down for guests because that's when we're going to start marching in. Mm -hmm. And they want, they want that to be clear. So. If you're going to give your tickets to a, a friend or something, tell them get there before 10 till 8 so you can get in and watch us walk in because that's a fun part to do. Um, the last thing I'm going to talk about today is about tickets. Everybody asks how many tickets. For sure, I can tell you on this day when this runs, I can guarantee everybody gets six tickets. I'm hoping we get at least one more. I'm still waiting to get the count, how many chairs South Florida Fairgrounds has, how many people are walking. And that's how I figure out the number of uh, uh, tickets. So we're six. I could look in the camera and say six for sure. I'm hoping for one more. But you'll find out at rehearsal practice for sure. Okay? 
And I think that's it. Um, graduation should be over by about 9.15 on that on that day we have it. What? Anything else, Mr. Cooper? I don't know. We talked about a lot, and I know we, we talked about it at our senior meeting. True. And we're talking about it now, but if you have any more questions, what do you think they should do? Come to you, Mr. Cooper. Come to me anytime, day or night. You know where I am. I, at lunchtime, I'm out in front of the 8,000 building. Mm -hmm. So anytime. Uh, Mr. Cooper, thank you, and have a wonderful thank day. Thank you. It's been a pleasure, as always. Thank you. And this is Demita from Chief Country, signing out. The Boys and Girls Club are hosting a summer camp here at Santa Lucia's High School from June 12th to July 17th. The camp will be from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Monday through Thursday. There will be outdoor sports activities, field trips, and breakfast and lunch will be served. The best part is that this will be all completely free. If you are interested in joining, scan the QR code. Bring Change to Minds presents Kite the Night, a multi-club collaboration where participants can play with kites, listen to great music, and enjoy select foods and beverage options. This will be a fun and unique night for all students. Please come and join us in the Santa Lucia's Courtyard on Friday, May 5th. Doors open at 5 p.m. and close at 7.30. Bring your friends. If you have any questions, please see your guidance counselor. Santa Lucia is participating in the Best Buddies Friendship Walk to raise money to support Best Buddies programs of inclusion for people worldwide with intellectual and developmental disabilities. It is free to attend the walk and you will earn community service hours for attending. It will be held on Saturday, April 22nd from 9 to 11 a.m. at the ballpark of the Palm Beaches in West Palm Beach. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Mangone. Hello there, I'm Alejandra with Chief TV and this is... Mrs. Mangone. Alrighty, I'm... Um... How are you today? I'm doing well, thank you. Alrighty, I was wondering if you could tell us about your group, Best Buddies? Right, so uh, we have a club called Best Buddies, which tries to promote friendship and inclusion on campus, um, especially to include people of all abilities. And there's a walk coming up um, next week that I'm asking people to participate. Can anyone participate? Yes, anyone can participate. We would love to have more members uh, join our team to represent Santa Lucia. Schools from all over the county participate in this. And last year, we had a team of about 12 walkers. So I'd really love to have more walkers this year. So anyone can participate. You can stop by my classroom. There's a QR code here to join our team. It's free to uh, join, and it's free to walk with us. And then on the day of the event, there's food there. There's music there. It's at the ballpark of the Palm Beaches in West Palm Beach, and the walk starts at 9 a.m. And um, community service hours are available for anyone who attends. Alrighty, thank you so much, Ms. Mangone. Thank you. Well, Chiefs, that's all we have for you today. I'm Alejandra. And I'm Juan, and have an amazing day.